Hey y'all, so I don't know if y'all heard, but recently Krishan was in Walmart and somebody recorded her with the baby looking like this. A lot of people are concerned and worried, like what is going on? So she recently posted something on her Instagram. I feel like instead of that lady recording me, she could have just helped me. I got a dog, two carts of full of... I need for my house, um... I'm calling my baby daddy. Is he helping? No. So I don't know why he's chiming in either. Uh, this mommy sh cool, but man, your mind is racing 36, eight hours a day. And then transitioning to being everything in my situation. I don't know, like everything is just overwhelming. Uh, I'm still learning. Um, I love my baby. He's a good baby. I'm gonna tighten up, straight up. You talking about Big Rock got this, you. Everybody make mistakes, period. She also did an Instagram live and talked a little bit more about it and talked about postpartum depression. I feel like the postpartum. <laughs> I was uh, at Walmart and What's up? You have to hold the baby, go shop. Like, what the? <laughs> <laughs> like, I am handicapped. I can't do anything a normal person can do. I'm trying. It's so, like, uh, hard. <laughs> and I start crying a little bit. Like, oh my God. And if it couldn't get any worse, my Jazzy Life decides to interject her opinion on the situation. So Jasmine says, my thing is, instead of recording her, why not go and help her? If I saw a mom struggling, look stressed, and baby doing a back bend, I would have offered to help her fix the carrier, especially if you know she's clearly a new mom from the blogs. Today's world is crazy. Needless to say, a lot of people are under this and saying a lot of things, especially stuff that makes her look like a bad mom. So this person says, you definitely need to sit this one out. You right behind her in line, needing the most parental advice. I scream every time I see your son nose full of snot, and you're sitting right there like you're blind to it. Girl, have a sit in the corner, please. And this person said, I don't think you're the one to be giving parenting advice, when all you did was lock your twins up and have them crying for food. When people tell you about it, you tell them to shut up and mind their business. You can't give advice if you're not willing to take it yourself. And this person said, People have been saying helpful things to this girl for weeks now concerning this baby. She basically has told everyone to mind their business and F off to say it nicely. Baby's been in the studio more than he's been in his crib, and I agree with the person above. You don't need experience to know that baby shouldn't be in that care like that. She also shouldn't be having her newborn in a loud studio making crappy music either. But I digress. Another one that's going to do what she wants to do until she has CPS knocking at her door because we all know people on the internet love to call CPS. You can't help hard-headed A people until it's already too late. Poor baby. Another person said she probably would have knocked you out to be honest. She doesn't take advice very well. So it appears a lot of people say that Krishan does not take advice. She doesn't want to hear what people have to say about her parenting. So let me know down in the comments what do you think about the situation? What do you think about Krishan holding the baby in the carrier like that? What do you think about Jasmine putting her two cents in in the situation? Should she have said anything or should she have sat this one out? Just let me know all of your thoughts and opinions in the comment section. Thank y'all so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will definitely see you in the next one.